Hey guys, this is Shannon Boudreaux out of Houma, Louisiana, and I've been with Life Vantage for probably about 11 years now. And um, just kind of let you guys know what happened here. Hurricane Ida decided to come and almost completely destroy actually everything here, but our house specifically. Uh, the roof came out, the ceilings came down in the house, and um, we watched it all happen. It was very scary and overwhelming. And um, after the, the next day, the power is out, the water's out, everything's out. You can't do anything but just kind of wait for help, and um, help came. So we got a phone call. It was from Tori, huh? Yeah. Got a phone call from Tori Hill that uh, Life Vantage was get, getting prepared to send us supplies and send us things down here. We had a generator. They gave us a generator, water, gas, just, it was just overwhelming because, sorry. It's just, it's just so hard after a storm because even if you have money in the bank, you can't access it. You, you, you can't call anybody because the phones are out. You know, you, can't, you just can't do anything but sit here and just watch your home and try to do what you can do, you know? So, sorry, I never cry. Um, I love it. It was just overwhelming. And, it, and, and even now today, it's even more overwhelming because um, when you're usually the one that goes out and helps everybody, it's super hard when everybody comes and helps you, you know? And so everybody just came down and um, <laughs> just started tearing the house down and went through every room and everything's gone now. And that's a huge pile of my house over there. Um, you know, it's just, uh, and, and I don't know. I, I just can't say thank you enough for everybody who helped donate and everybody who came and actually, like, I just want to say one thing. Oh my God. The ladies from corporate and, and <laughs> oh my god they have y'all like they have been swinging hammers for hours and they have not stopped i am thoroughly impressed so impressed and the men too i'm so sorry i don't mean to think about that they've been doing so much and and steep like so Oh my God, he's in my house and he was pulling floors up and ripping drywall down and I just, I can't thank you enough. Thank you so much. I've never felt so just humbled and loved and cool. Woo! Woo! I'm going to turn it over to Steve and stop crying. Well, this has been amazing. You know, I was, um, I was fortunate to be raised by some parents who taught us at a very young age about the power of service. And um, I think the lessons that they tried to teach us were around um, helping people in need, but also flipping our perspective. That life isn't about us, it's about what we do to help other people. And, and um, you know, my time with Life Vantage has done nothing but reinforce the level of family and community that we have and when tragedies strike what we do is we pull together um, and and you know our, our legacy program it, it's real we touch people's lives um, a, a weekend ago we were at a pro 5 summit tying knots in blankets to, to give to um, a primary children's hospital um, We've, uh, a month ago, we were in Cabo. Uh, we built a, a, a kitchen for a, a woman's and child's shelter. Uh, we go down and we build houses in Mexico each year. And I think it's those activities that bring us together. It defines who we are as a company, as a community, and, and as a family. And, and what you do is you take care of your family. So it's been great being here. Um, I wish you could all have felt the camaraderie and the love of, of people helping one another that were in need at this time. So I'm just honored to be part of this organization and for all of the support that uh, we collectively provide for one another. And Michelle Oborn um, is, is fantastic. She, she leads the cry from a corporate standpoint of uh, our legacy program. I know it's it's near and dear to her. She also has to deal with a lot of HR stuff. I think she tolerates that in order to do what her passion is, which is our legacy program. So, Michelle. Woo! Woo! I just feel like 
it's important to know we are just representatives of everyone else out there who made the donations, who took the time, who had the passion and heart to be here because it's, it is about the community. It's about what we're doing together. And, you know, while we're the ones here, we know that there are hundreds out there who donated the money to get that generator here. And, you know, a special shout out to Tori, Fred, Sunny, because Joe and Joe, Joe. Joe for like knowing who we needed to help down here and how to get him help because we we were able to like get the money and get it down here but they're the ones who drove to find what was needed and bring it back so it really is a big family lift and we wouldn't want it any other way right this is, this is the best part Let's eat. Let's eat. Let's eat. <laughs> Can you say jambalaya? Uh, jambalaya and white beans. Jambalaya. That's one thing us Cajuns do is we eat. <laughs>